the West Virginia legislative session is headed toward the home stretch as Monday is the last day for state senators to introduce bills in the upper chamber. One of the newest bills heading to the Senate floor would allow for the collection and storage of DNA samples from suspects who have been indicted on charges of sexual offenses, involuntary manslaughter or domestic violence. A similar bill died in the state house over privacy concerns, but the bill sponsor, Republican Mike Oliverio of Montegalia and Marion counties, says the database where these samples will be stored has never been breached. This database, though, with the, that collects this DNA has been enforced for over 60 years, and it's never once been breached. It's protected by state laws and federal laws and protected by the FBI. So I understand people have privacy concerns, but I hope that I can assure them that that the protections are there in place to protect their privacy. All 50 states collect DNA samples at the point of conviction, but West Virginia is one of just 19 states not to collect DNA samples upon a suspect's arrest. The legislative session concludes on Saturday, March 9th.